Alrighty, so first what we're going to go ahead and do is prime the eye, and I'm going to use Too Faced Shadow Insurance. Oops. Apply it on the eye. Now I'm going to go ahead and use a white base. My base is Ryan Way X, as always. And apply it to the And then I'm going to use my finger to blend it out. Next, I'm going to go ahead and take a white shadow, and this is going to be by MAC, and it's called White Frost. And you really can't see it, but it's White Frost. And take my Sony Cashew Black Shadow Brush, tap off the access, and just apply it on the lid. Next, I'm going to go ahead and take Maybelline's Color Tattoo, and the color is 20 Painted Purple. That's what it looks like in my eyeliner brush. And I'm going to use this for my cut crease. Next, now what I'm going to go ahead and do is take my Sephora Quad and Eyeliner Palette. And this was the eyeliner, or is the eyeliner. And I'm basically going to be using this purple and this purple here. And this is called Eternally Purple Number 4. So first I'm going to take like a smudge brush. And I'm going to dip it in the light purple first. Lighter purple. And just apply it right over the color tattoo. Now I'm going to take a blending brush and use the dark purple and with light strokes I'm going to go over the lighter purple I don't know if you guys can tell so far but both eyes are actually different um, this one, I actually tried to do it more so to look like Nikki's eye, which comes down into a little swoop a little bit. Kind of gives it a little wing look, which she always usually has. And this one is more of my eye shape, where it just goes across and to the side. And for the highlight, I really don't want a bright highlight, so I'm just going to use Revlon's Color Ready um, Press Powder. Or Photo Ready, excuse me. Now I'm going to take my Wet n Wild um, cream, cream Eyeliner and another eyeliner brush. And now we're going to line the eye. Now I'm going to take my um, mascara, and this is by Sephora, and it's black. Now I'm going to go ahead and take my black eyeliner, and this is by NYX. Line the lower lash line. Now it's time for lashes, so I'll be back with my lashes on. Now I'm going to go ahead and prime my face. And again, this is Magic Smooth by L'Oreal. Is it by L'Oreal? Yeah, by L'Oreal. Now for foundation, I'm going to be using MAC Studio Fix Fluid, and mine is NW45. Apply it on here. And then take my Revlon foundation brush. And go ham on my face. Now I'm going to set the pow the foundation with Revlon's uh, Photo Ready Powder. Now I'm going to conceal my eye. My eyes are. You got some cute. You got some. And all the girls. So for my highlight, I'm going to use Max um, Press uh, Studio Fix um, Powder, and this was C4. The name got rubbed off on the back. Let me just use a wedge. 
and apply it under my eye. Apply some right here. And then the chin. In the middle of my forehead. And then the rubber band. Pin down my nose. And my cupid bow. Now I'm going to take my 163 brush by MAC and a darker shade. This is also Studio Fix by MAC. Um, don't remember the name. It came off as well. You hear how fake my earrings are? <laughs> now I'm just gonna marry all the colors together. Next, I'm gonna go ahead and take Elf's Blush. Blush. And it's actually brighter than my camera stuck. And this is called Pink Passion. I'm gonna take Sonia Cashew Face Brush. And apply it to my cheeks. So for the lips, I'm going to take NYX um, lip liner, and this is called Pinky. Wearing the lips. And now we're just going to fill it in. Now I'm going to take um, a pearly pink lipstick. And this was by Avon, I believe. For the gloss, I'm going to take NYX's Pink Ballerina, or Ballerina Pink. Next, Max Finishing Spray. And we're done. This is the complete look. Nikki's eye. My eye shape. <laughs> but yeah, so thanks again for watching, you guys. Um, I'll see you all next time. Get your request in. You want to see something that Nikki has? Let me know and I'll do it for you. Alright, bye.